right there. Mm -hmm. Nobody cares about Scarlett Johansson. Me. That bitch ain't shit. You crazy. You she looks like average as hell as an average white girl. Average, average looking white junk. Tattoo through the, through the what she is. What's an average looking white junk. What you say before? Is it the an average looking. Uh, zero. A zero. <laughs> She's a zero. <laughs> She's a zero. Get you a hero. <laughs> Drop that zero and get with it. Right. Yeah. What he said. What he said. Drop that zero and get Drop with the that hero. Chicken dinner and get with the winner. Yeah, and she ain't it. That ain't it. She ain't it. No. <laughs> no. You see? Volume me, man. Nobody cares Volume about me. Scarlett what, what, Johansson. What, 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 what remote control is? Volume me, man. It don't work no more. Volume yeah, we don't need the volume on. Volume me. She and me. That's it right there. I'm looking for that joint. You need to drop that zero and get Man, with the hero. Red bag, all right, now. You talk your ass on the red bag, all right? I mean, the it's red cool. bag, all right? I mean, I was already stoned because the blood uh, that she no, had. That's why we don't need you to we try it. Right. Oh, I'm, I'm just smoking it. I'll try it next time. Going, I'll come bite sober next time. It's a red bag right yeah. there. Mm -hmm. Red bag there. What's going on with it right Guys, I go home tomorrow. I'm making a YouTube video. I go home tomorrow, guys. You've been saying... Well, actually, I go Saturday. You've been mm -hmm. saying this for four days. What? That you're going home tomorrow or something. I've been missing for four days. I, I've been over here. Uh, I haven't been over here. I'm lost. I haven't been saying I've been going home been for four days. I got my plane ticket uh, the other day. And I actually fly out of St. Louis on Saturday. Me and Brittany are going to St. Louis tomorrow at checkout. We're going to stay the night in St. Louis, and she's going to throw me on the airplane Saturday morning, and then I'm Silly flying home. How's <laughs> Brittany doing? Good. Good. When you come to Springfield and you go at your house, you go to a store, a mall, a restaurant, you're going to see probably 95% white women. You know what I'm saying? Now, it's certain areas you can go to where it's going to be some more black people. Like, so, what do I supposed to do? I'm supposed to be the oddball and pick one Asian motherfucker in an all white town? Come on now. That ain't making no sense. I'm looking at what's available. All white meat. All white meat. All white meat. All American. Right. Like cashew chicken. Yeah, I still, I still got it. When I go to the Chinese restaurant there, I already know what I want, man. All, all white meat. All white meat, man. Scarlett Johansson. Right. Charlotte Johansson. That's what I'm getting, man. Cheese. Yeah. Hey, man. Okay. You know what I'm saying? That's what happened. I used to be sitting around my party. It's not aggravating, it's antagonizing. <laughs> there you go. There you go to work. Antagonizing. I used, no. I used to be sitting around my party to do this There's type no of shit around here. We'll do that shit and then. Yeah, what is wrong he with done well been goddamn and went to go shoot up some shit because yeah. cause we done been saying this shit to him all day. We just don't know. We done drove our partner yeah, to fucking jail right. or to get killed. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's almost a sort of peer pressure, too. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm telling you. Church. I ain't bullshit. I used, I used to be nosing that shit. Like, church right now. So while we at, like, like, it's certain hell. areas, because I don't want to just put it down and say, like, on a pencil, but, like, that's why I grew up. But in right. certain areas, this going on every day. Mm -hmm. and when we get up in the motherfucker, get up and want to let some steam up. You know what I'm saying? So what's up with your movie, Mosquito? Who that is? Oh, the Mosquito <laughs> movie. Oh, well, you know, I'm going to be honest with you. I, I got a little discouraged because... Back when I really initially thought of it and started writing the script, you know what I'm saying? Somebody came out with one. Oh shit. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? So even I didn't though know I, it wasn't it wasn't nothing like what I was planning on doing and it still ain't gonna be better. Right. I just ain't never get back to it yet. Oh well you need to get rid of it. I'm glad you remind me though. Yeah. yeah, I did. No, see once you said mosquito, it reminded me he has a movie. Yeah. He had a movie named yeah. he's gonna call Mosquito. See, you gotta yeah. understand something. Yeah. I didn't experience the mosquitoes for real, so. I know you have. And I, I know firsthand what they'll do to you. So, like, <laughs> people just say mosquito, and people be like, I'm up in Missouri. I'm not printed at all, but like white people think a little different. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And people see a mosquito, and they be like, Oh, it's just a little bug. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> no. These bitches is vampires, man. Yeah. It's not no it's little bug, man. Huh? It's for you. Huh? What's going on with you? Oh, it's blue truck. 
Yeah, you know what I'm saying? So uh, I'm still mm. sitting here. I got tea. Yeah. And give me the five mosquitoes minutes. are different down there than up here. Yeah, yeah because what I'm saying is yeah. they're down. They're These worse down in Arkansas vampires, than they are here. They're vampires, though. They're vampires down there. Right. Imagine this. Thought I got a big right, ear at that, that moment. You sitting right here right now. You pretty comfortable. You know what I'm saying? You ain't at your home where you want to be, but you comfortable. You comfortable while you visiting. So what I'm saying is, it doesn't matter. Now ain't nothing bothering you. Ain't no bug down on you or nothing. Now, what if all of a sudden 60 fucking little ass bugs that get to swarm around you and some of them motherfuckers might bite your ass? But they just swarm around somebody. You can't even do this right here. There were three of them motherfuckers across your ass. And then you move your arm like this, you feel 10 or 20 of them motherfuckers. You're going to make me have nightmares. That's a horror story. I live in the woods. There's not yeah, them type of bug attacks. All right. What's the woods? This is hilarious. You, these mosquitoes are some different shit. Oh, I know. Not in the crossbred. They got hybrids up now. They got these little white dots on their back now. There's some different motherfuckers. Thank you. Them brown ones, they make the kill. Wow, folks. This is hilarious. I, I, okay, now, what did you just say? Where did you get her from? I wrote a lot of these songs that's already out. I already had wrote them before they ever came out. Even what songs? A bunch of them, some of your favorite hits. Which is what? <laughs> Any one of them. Her favorite hits. You know what I'm saying? I just thought the song that these people rapping already in my head. Before. This man is so delusional, I don't even know what's going on with life. Listen to the song. He gonna tell you what they think right now. What they this is Gucci Mane. Right. So you, right. you, you, you so you wrote this Gucci yeah. Mane song that I'm gonna get a copyright for on my video. This, they're this. definitely gonna copyright me because you're on. saying you wrote this. Back on. That's the point of the copyright on it. Listen, back on. I wouldn't get paid for this if I was getting paid, but I'm not, so it don't matter. Bye. Okay. So, Double Up, I have a question for you. Uh -oh. How did you get your name? Uh -oh. mm. um, it was given to It was given to you. Yep, the, street, the, street the streets gave it, gave it to you. Yep. Oh, okay, okay, okay. All right. That's what's up. And how old were you whenever the streets gave you this name? Oh. Uh, Adley, I had another name first. Then when I got that name, I probably about, I don't know. I, I just say this right here. I ain't going to say no age. I'm going to say it was like 15 years ago. 15 years ago. Okay. Yeah. Um, What was your name before Double Up? Well, yeah. Oh, uh, well, I ain't going to speak on that right now. Oh, okay. All right. Yeah. All right. Well, how was it growing up in West Memphis on the south side? It was cool. It was just, you know, typical shit. Right. Small town, like, uh, it, it, people act like it's a city, but it's just a small town. Right. Like next to a city. Because people always assume, because you're from West Memphis, Arkansas, that you're in Memphis, but it's really a different state just because they hear the West Memphis part. But it's right. really totally different from the actual Memphis, Tennessee. Right. So... Yeah, and people just don't understand I'm that. Gonna, so I'm gonna go and define it for the people who don't know. Okay. The reason why it's called West Memphis is because Memphis don't have a west side. Basically, that's what it is. They got a west okay. wood, but like it's right on the edge of the like the boundary line when they turn to Arkansas. It's like it's on the East Memphis, South Memphis, and North Memphis. You don't hear nobody saying I'm from West Memphis unless you're from West Memphis, Arkansas. Okay, 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 okay. So there's nobody that lives in Tennessee that say I'm from West Memphis. No. Okay, they okay, okay. From West Wood, that's a neighborhood like right on the west end of this of the state. Of the okay. City, of the city, bro. That's yeah. what's up. I did not even know that with uh, having a boyfriend that is also from West Memphis, Arkansas. Yeah. That's interesting. But I mean, it ain't number like five minutes, like right the time over a you bridge. Go to the fucking Gas station from your nearest gas station, like that's how fast it is to get across the Arkansas Tennessee line. Right, 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 right. Interesting, interesting, interesting. So, you're a car guy. Yeah. You like to buy little cars. You like to fix them up. You like to do whatever. I'm sure you'd like a nice car, a Lamborghini, all that. What has? What is the favorite car that you have ever owned yourself? Damn. 
that's kind of hard now because I'm, I'm mostly was in the old school, but like every now and then I I go outside the box and get something like an exotic or something like that. Oh, okay. Every now and then. That's what's up. That's what's up. Okay, cool. If you were like a millionaire, what would you get? Car? Yeah. Um, like what's I your get, dream I get car? Some made. I get some made. Something made. I'm always thinking I go get some custom. I get some bad design and make me some like I like to be the only person with it. That's what I like to be. That's impossible with it. Right, 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 right. Yeah. What do you feel about a Tesla? They be at the rental car place all the time. I go get rental cars and shit. I don't mm -hmm. even never take them. They be trying to give them away. You just you don't want to mess with it. No, nah, I mean. Maybe if it was your own. No, I mean, I, I probably would enjoy driving one. It's different. That's what I'm about to different. You know, it's different, but... You got to learn. It ain't nothing that I want. It ain't nothing that I want. Bro. I think I'd have to study one first, especially if I was rental carring it. Like, just because I don't know nothing about it, how to drive one, so you know <clears> what I mean? Yeah, I heard too many war stories about them. Right. How would you feel like letting it drive itself and you're like, woo? I ain't doing none of that. Right. Right. I feel that. 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 Um, so you also, you're, you're, you're many, you wear many hats. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> you're also, you used, you're a, a producer, musician, rapper, all that. What was your first song? I don't even know. Cause I never, I, I would say I, I used to be a rapper because I did used to be a rapper. But like when I used to really rap, I didn't never take it serious. Like it was more like a hobby. Right. So it was like, I made like several songs, so I don't even remember the first one. Like, it was all playing, though. It was just playing. Right. Just playing, but it was, it was all right. Right, 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 right. Oh, okay, okay, okay. How old were you when you started? Um, wow, well, when I started rapping for real, yeah. probably about, she 15 or something, probably less than that. Oh wow! Okay. I always rap like you know. It's just I'm, your thing, your I hobby. I say my age and shit, but I'm old. Not that old, but I'm old. So I remember like we used to take a cassette tape and then fill up the little hole on the yep. bottom. Yep. Yep. And re-record like, over you know, what was already on it. Yeah. This <laughs> yeah. So like yeah, I mean I, for us not professional, I got yeah, I got a bunch of shit songs. You know what I'm saying? Like right. Yeah. My favorite is "Don't Stop" on. The Double or Nothing album on mixtape. So you go download the mixtape album. It was a mixtape app. Right. And then I put in Double or Nothing and it pops up. And that's my favorite song it is Double. It was what? No, what did I just say? Don't Stop. I appreciate it. Yeah, that's my favorite song. <clears throat> yep, 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 yep. So who do you, so in we'll say in general, growing up, who do you look up to in general? You mean like? Did you? Like, like a famous person, like oh, you. We'll start like, with the famous person. Oh, like a famous person. Well, I came up and really in the Master P area, and it was okay. like Master P. But like now, that things have changed a little bit. I'm gonna be on with that. I'd probably say Fifty Cent. Fifty Cent. Okay. Oh, I like Fifty Cent. I can agree with you on that. Yeah. I grew up listening to Fifty Cent also. So, um, what about like you, your people in your life? Like what? What you mean? What? Like family or somebody? Who would you look up to? Well, oh, in my family. Yep. Man, that's a lot of them. I can't just. That's name good. My, I got some cousins. I got some cousins that you know I looked up to. Antoine. That's my friend. I mean. Oh, he's not. Your I, I look up to him for a lot of certain things. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. You okay. Know what All right. Well, what about music in West Memphis? Who do you look up to? I don't look up to nobody on no music. When you were listening, when you say, were young, who did you that, listen to? Let me make that clear, not to be rude. Right, because you're the best uh, of the best we nah, know. No, 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 I don't look up to nobody I'm because sure. really most of the, the reason why I said that, we can go and get that out of the way, it because most of the guys that's doing music now, I kind of watch them grow up or something, so. Yeah. I, I can't really look up to them, you know what I'm saying? But, right. But for it's like. Well, I, when I, you I, were I, younger I, growing like, up listening to music. In West Memphis? Yeah. Shit. I don't even know. Was there a musician? I thought I felt I like there was maybe some musician. I had probably a couple of uh, you know, people in my town that, that did music, but um, nobody really, man. It's just like, it's the same thing when you come from where I'm from. 
come from the three six mafia, the player flies and all that kind of shit. Mm -hmm. Your right. God, even your goddess. I don't hey, it. what did you just say? I don't <laughs> I ain't, I ain't gonna, That's I funny. I'm gonna say what I really want to say, but yeah, even right. your goddess. Yeah. Right, 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 right. All right. Well, we're gonna take a break, and I may or may not be back. All right. You got any words for my video, my people? All I'm gonna say is go to your local smoke shop and get your Grand Official smoke gear. I got the fucking uh, grinder, and I got the trays, and the fucking uh, smoking papers and cigars is on the way. Right. Yeah. All right. So, yep, go there and get that. All right. I'll peace out. Okay, guys, I am officially leaving Double Ups. I'm going back to my room and I fly back home to Florida or I'm heading that way tomorrow anyways. I'm not quite flying home there, but I'm heading the direction of where I'm flying. I'll get to that later. So, um, Double Up, thank you for the interview. I'll talk with you more later. And uh, I had fun uh, chatting with you. And you two weird motherfucker that just walked in the background, you know, y'all don't need to know about him. It's okay. Don't worry about it. But, um, <laughs> all right, guys. Deuces. Thank you for subscribing. Comment below if you have anything to say, and I'll see you later.